okay, we're loaded up and we're gonna go and do a recce of um, some pubs not too far from Brisbane. So we're gonna do an overnighter at uh, Linville and maybe um, to Goolawa esque some of the pubs are uh, out in the Somerset region. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so um, we'll go and get some photos and we'll let you know all about it. Cheers. Cheers. So we're just heading uh, through Woodford at the moment. Um, we're going to look at a few pubs and look at a few pubs that have got the free camping with them hopefully. Um, we'll stay at Linville tonight. Um, we'll get some footage there because we're trying to plan a uh, three day... Pub crawl. Yeah, well, wine, pub crawl, beer cup, whatever. <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll, we'll catch some videos anyway and, and post it up. But uh, looking forward to the next catch up with the Stony Creek guys, that's for sure, because they were so lovely. Anyone. Anyone, and more. Yeah. Wine for the ladies, beer for the boys. Yeah, I like wine. <laughs> yeah, anyway. And welcome to Linville. up at Linville across the road from the pub and there's a, uh, a few people here just have a look we've just stopped there we won't, we won't unhitch we're only here overnight um, they call this the old station this is a old railway station up there there's no lines uh, a couple of old carriages so we've got some uh, some neighbors here behind Having a wave. There we go. And we'll probably see them in the uh, in the pub later later tonight. Oh well, I guess we're officially now. Rain Hermates, down for a drive on a Friday night to a country pub. Stay across the road, drink, sleep, and do it again tomorrow night in a different pub. <laughs> Living the dream. Morning. Morning. Good morning. Um, crisp morning in Linfield, and uh, a lot more people seem to turn up overnight. Um, you can see behind me there a few more vans. Um, there's an event on a uh, on the Brisbane Valley Trail ride today, and lots of uh, people on their bikes are participating in that. Um, looks like a bit of fun, you know. Well, thinking of putting a bike rack on the uh, the back of the van and um, although none of these people seem to have electric bikes so I'll have an unfair advantage because I'm not pedaling up hills
Okay, we've come for a little drive. Uh, we're in the main street of Tagulawa, out the front of the pub, or one of the pubs. Looks like there's three of them here. Um, doesn't look like the place for a, um, a pub crawl for uh, vans, because there's no way really to park your van. Uh, you could go up to the showgrounds, but um, uh, that's too far away. All right, driving through to Gulawawa, we saw a whole lot of cars uh, parked up in a paddock. We thought, um, what's going on there? So being in the curious, uh, wandering huckleberries we are, we decided to come up and check it out. And what do you know? What's on? Uh, a show at the showgrounds. The Tagulawa Country Show. So uh, we paid our 15 bucks each and now we're going to go in and uh, check it out. Guess what I found? Woohoo! Yep, that's where I'm going. My money's on Kevin Bacon. <laughs> that's him just having a feed there. Lawnmower racing. Alright, made a few uh, friends already at the S Caravan Park. Um, next to us, uh, they've got a couple of dogs, and of course, Michelle loves to go and say, he say hello to any dogs. So she's done that, and uh, we're all set up. Um, yeah, and here we go. Got uh, the staff wanting to be uh, filmed on camera. And uh, very friendly staff here, too, by the way. Um, it's got a uh, big communal area open fire tonight. And Apparently some live music too, so we'll check that out a little bit later. Right now, we're going to go to the pub. Check out the menu. Well, what do you know? We've been in uh, Esk at the caravan park for, what, uh, five minutes? And we've bumped into a uh, another Stony Creek 15 owner who was waving us at the street. You know, we didn't know who this uh, fellow was, but here he is. G'day, Robert's the name. Um, we've had our Stony Creek since January and loving it. And yeah, I've done quite a few trips already in it and having a great time, yeah. There you go. Uh, we passed one other Stony on the way out here. I called them up on the CB, but uh, obviously they weren't on the uh, CB. And here we are at uh, Esk. Um, yeah, bumping into uh, the rest of the uh, Stony Creek guy. family. So, um, the if you see Robert uh, out and about, make sure you go and introduce yourself. No worries. Ah, Cheers. Okay. Um, time to do a little uh, walk around the S Caravan Park. I mean, it looks sensational here. Look at the escarpment behind me. Look at that. That is just huge. Just looks fantastic. Wow. Um, Really friendly caravan park here. You know, they've got some live music on right now. And uh, they do do um, wood fire pizzas uh, from time to time, which they're not doing tonight, unfortunately. Uh, we went up to the pub, had a look at the menu. Menu looks okay. Um, a little bit on the pricey side. And now that we've met a few people here, we're thinking, uh, I think we'd rather be here talking to them 
socialising than going up to the pub and having a $45 steak. Now, two of those, 90 bucks and a few drinks. We're not getting out of there for any less than $120. So, um, yeah, let's uh, do what you do. Obviously, there's some full-time residents here, like this one, that uh, obviously collects old bikes. And uh, it's a form of art, no doubt, if you can appreciate uh, old bikes as art. Anyway, um, yeah, I think I'm in the residential section. Um, definitely in the residential section, which is not where I um, was intending to go. So I'll turn around and see if I can find our other Stony Creek friend. Well, that's not usually the way you uh, bring your caravan to a caravan park. <laughs> so there's a story behind this one. Good morning from S Caravan Park. Um, it's breakfast time, got the missus on the tools, and uh, she's doing a, a pretty good job too. Aren't you? Yep, always cooking. <laughs> always cooking. And cleaning. Yeah, uh, that's not really my thing. I'm not really good cook. I could do everything else really well, but cooking, no, not so much. Mm -hmm. Isn't that right? Yep. Yeah, pretty much. Hang on, get rid so, of that shadow and say that again. So we have bacon, we have tomato, we have hash browns in the air fryer, we have, and what did I say, tomato, bacon, eggs, mm. and hash browns, and some toast, and juice, and coffee. Excellent. I think I'm going to keep this one. <laughs> All right, it's time to uh, blow this joint, get out of Dodge, so to speak. We've uh, said goodbye to our friends in the other stony 15 who are also packing up and heading uh, back up the range to Toowoomba and uh, seeing it's our eldest daughter's birthday today we uh, better get back for that otherwise we'll be in trouble hey mm -hmm. all right so uh, look out for uh, this video um, which will be up in uh, a couple of weeks well don't bother looking out for it because um, by the time you hear me say that you'll be watching it already duh Ah, good. <laughs> All right, see ya.